In the present poster, we represented four different studies aim at testing the mechanism underlying aldocentric perspective taking in natural scenes. In detail, something from the literature showing the existence of egocentric and altercentric biases in visual perspective taking when another person viewpoint conflicts with our own, we wanted to investigate whether these biases persist in real world scenes. Thus, in the first study, 157 participants performed a visual perspective taking task in which they had to judge in natural scene the number of red discs seen by their own or by another character depicted in the scene. This study is divided into two parts, the first in which participants have to judge only the self perspective and the second in which they had to judge both self and other perspectives. Results from study one showed a consistency half at only when self and other perspective conditions were mixed and not when we tested self perspective in isolation. Thus, this result suggests that in real life visual perspective taking, egocentric and altercentric biases persist only when other perspective was explicit to prompt to be taken into account. Then, starting from the literature showing that adults are fostered to detect a change in a scene when an individual appearing in that scene was gazing at the changing object, we designed three more studies aimed and investigated whether the agent's awareness can moderate the gaze cue and effect, and whether the agent gaze cue and effect persists in real world natural scene when the agent is embedded in that scene. To do so, 170 participants, 163 and 88 participants participated to the three different studies in which they had to detect a change in natural scene in a flicker paradigm for change detection. In all the studies, case allocation was manipulated within subject. In addition, avatar awareness was manipulated through glasses color within subject in study two and between subject in study three, while in study four, avatar awareness was not manipulated. Regarding the results of from study two, three, and four, we found neither an effect of awareness nor an effect of gaze location in any of the studies. These results suggest that in real life, if you are not prompt to consider other perspective, this does not facilitate the detection of a change. Overall, our results suggest that in everyday life, implicit mentalizing would be too cognitive demanding, and thus a docentic perspective taking was activated only in those situations that explicit require to take other perspective.